The gold standard in screening for breast cancer, the traditional two-view x-ray technique is coming under fire. While it may find cancer, it doesn't measure risk. Detecting some precancers like cells that are contained within the milk duct and have little chance of evolving. What they're probably talking about is low-grade ductal carcinoma in situ. And some people think that that is over-treated and that it might, you don't know for sure that it would ever turn into cancer, an invasive cancer that might kill someone. But doctors aren't discounting the value of a mammogram. Our whole goal really is to find cancer before it's detectable by feeling a mass. So if we can see something on the mammogram that's abnormal, biopsy it and find out that it is cancer, it's typically easily treated. More recently, the FDA approved a second breast cancer screener, adding ultrasound to the arsenal. It may help doctors get a read on more difficult cases or give another perspective on dense, hard to read tissue. It just has the ability to, you know, kind of travel differently through the tissue and provide you with a different view. We use it a lot of times when someone has a, a spot that they feel because we can, you know, directly target that area to look and see if there is a, a mass there. Finding cancer early is not a fix, but gives doctors a starting point to evaluate the disease and its prospects. A lot of the early stage cancers we find are, you know, from seeing those calcifications on mammogram. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.